Okay, two things before I properly begin with this video. First of all, I've just filmed a 35 minute long video which is not going up anytime soon, but therefore I might not have much camera space left. And second of all, many many weeks slash months slash years ago, I found out about this YouTube video I guess called Almost One Hour of Calm Dodie Songs and it is my life saver. It's so lovely to just have it playing in the background. The only thing I'm upset about is that I'm pretty sure Dodie doesn't get anything out of it when we listen to this instead of on her channel and I almost wish she could put it on her channel so she can get the money or whatever, but I love listening to it. Okay, and now into today's video, which I absolutely have not prepared anything for, so let's see how that goes. Oh, actually, yes, today I tried using a new thing, like a mousse on my hair. I'm not convinced. Look, the problem with my hair is that it doesn't matter what I do. I could do the exact same thing one wash to another wash and it will always give me different results. So I don't know if this is from the mousse or if it's just, if it was gonna happen anyway. And it does feel a little bit more curly and a little bit more defined. Also though, the entire time I let it dry, like the full few hours, I had my head over so it was all like this, which meant when I actually finally moved it, I had so much hair that was just like up and over and I couldn't get it back. Sort of had to force it back eventually. And I have to say, it doesn't feel as soft, my hair. It's not a mousse that sort of just lets your hair feel soft. I guess. Anyway, we'll find out also in the next few days if it does anything for longer term because I always find the more days I don't wash, the less curly my hair gets. And it's less frizzy, I find. So I guess that's good. But if you have any tips for curly hair, for products or things that I can find in Australia, because there's lots of stuff in England, but I can't find anything here, let me know. Oh my goodness, I don't have any notes. What am I supposed to do when the best part of me was always you and... So, one thing I do want to say is that we are nearing the end of June, as of when you are seeing this, not as of when I am filming this. I think I've still got a couple of days, so I'm not too stressed. But at the same time, I can't imagine not making videos into July, as in daily videos. But at the same time, I don't want to keep pushing off my book challenge videos, and I think there was one other thing as well that's going up then. So maybe what I could do is just do July series, as I've done with May and June, and then put those videos in, like I just have some days where I have two videos a day, like I could do morning and night. I might just want to do that, because I really don't want to be pushing those off till August, but at the same time, I don't want to not do anything in July because as it's looking at the moment at least, I'm gonna be stuck here anyway. And I just, I enjoy making these videos, it gives me something to do. Although I have to say, it was really funny, at the start of this year, I had two thoughts in my head about my YouTube channel. Number one, there is no way I'm gonna beat last year, so 2019, the amount of videos, because I think I did 125. And I just thought, no way. But second of all, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to make close to any of my other videos because I know I'm going to be busy this year. And then coronavirus hit. And I'm now already on something like 65, maybe 70 videos. That's crazy. Like, I was hoping for maybe 50 this year. And I've already gone way past that. But I'm not doing it so I have more YouTube videos. Like, that's not the reason I make the YouTube videos. It just ends up happening when I have a bit more time that I just make more videos. And to me, the idea of it ending I just don't like that, it doesn't feel right. So I think, I'm saying it here, it might change in the next few days, but I'm saying it here, I'm gonna continue this series thing into July, but I will do two videos a day for some of the days, as opposed to now where I said I'm not doing that. So there you have it. Also, it's the most beautiful sunset outside, but only in one specific corner that is covered by a house, so I can't see it, which is sad. Okay, I'm gonna end the video here, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!